Hi Aqua Bloomers. Welcome to another video from Aqua Blooms about application of inorganic fertilizer in a growing lotus plant. Let's bloom together. Lotus plants use tremendous amount of energy to produce flowers while continuing to develop healthy root system and grow its leaves for photosynthesis. So the plant need extra supply of essential nutrients to grow healthy once we raise it in a tub or pot. In this condition, a fertilizer supplement would help the plant to get all these nutrients. What's a fertilizer? A fertilizer is a natural or artificial substance containing chemical elements that improve growth, flowering and productiveness of the plant. Fertilizers are basically grouped into two, organic fertilizers and inorganic fertilizers. Organic fertilizers are agricultural waste, livestock manure, municipal sludge etc. and inorganic fertilizers are NPK fertilizers. NPK stands for nitrogen N, phosphorus, P, and potassium, K. NPK is the basic food for lotus plant containing all the three primary nutrients required for its healthy growth. How nutrients in NPK work for the plant? Nitrogen in NPK helps in growth of leaves, stem and vegetation. Phosphorus increases disease resistance and flowering. Potassium enhances good growth of root and root system. How we supply NPK fertilizer to a lotus plant? It's needed to fertilize growing lotus plant at regular intervals. But how often we need to fertilize plants depends on the cultivar we are growing and the time of the year. Large cultivars like green apple, satabonkat etc. need more dosage than medium to bowl lotus cultivars. Fertilize the lotus plant only after it's having aerial leaves because if we fertilize too soon, it may burn the plant. At Aqua Blooms, we use slow release water soluble NPK fertilizer 12, 32, 16 for optimum growth and best blooms. Feed the lotus once in every month or in every three weeks. Begin with a half dose, means half teaspoon of NPK fertilizer per 23-24 liters of water in the tub or pot, to avoid burning the new growth. Wrap up the fertilizer in a piece of newspaper and simply press it into the soil just away from the roots of the lotus, taking care not to damage the roots. Increase the fertilizer quantity gradually in subsequent doses as the plant grows. In this way, fertilize the lotus plant throughout its growing or blooming season and give last dose of fertilizer just before beginning of winter season. This will help the lotus plant to use up all the remaining fertilizer in the pot and encourages the plant to go into dormancy naturally and produce healthy tubers. Hope these bits of knowledge would be useful for all of you. Thank you for watching this video, please like and share it among other aquatic plant lovers and their groups. Happy Gardening!